Today we're going to show you a quick, easy upgrade you can do to any 2015 through 2017 Mustang, along with your 2015 through 2020 Shelby. That blacked out look is still really popular among S550 enthusiasts. We've shown you several different ways you can black out all the lights on your Mustang using tint. Now, one question we always get when doing those videos is the headlights, because if you tint the entire headlight, you are going to lose some light output. What we're going to show you today is a way to add that tinted look and get rid of this amber without losing any light output. This tint kit is sold as a pair, and what it does is it blacks out the amber corner reflectors on your factory headlights. So you get that smoked look for the entire headlight without diminishing any kind of the light output. The insulation is pretty simple. All you'll need is a clean towel, some water with a little bit of soap mixed into it, a squeegee, and a hairdryer or heat gun. Now, if you haven't already, the first thing you want to do is clean the light surface itself like you normally would. Grab a little bit of this and then wet the area where it's going to go. Now, grab your film. Again, make sure it's the correct side. I'm going to peel this off and spray this as well. With both sides went, you want to put the tint up in the place and then line it up with the body lines and then start working the water out from the inside center to the outside edges. And then once you have the water worked out, we're going to grab our heat gun. If you're using a heat gun, you want it at a cooler setting, don't go crazy hot. Sort of start working it. You start in the middle, just work your way out, so that way you can work the bubbles out. The best way to do this, again, is low heat and just take your time. I and mean, if you try to heat it up too much and rush through it, you'll get bubbles and you can actually damage the film. The amber corner blackout is very, very simple to install. It really changes up the look of your headlights. You get that blacked out look without losing any kind of light output. And if you're considering tinting the other lights, this is a great way to start. These are inexpensive. They'll give you a feel for what it's like to actually tint the lights and see if it's something you want to do yourself. As far as the installation goes, you give yourself about 20 minutes to a half an hour and you'll be back on the road in no time. 